the two Kashmiri giants posing with the American photographer James, 1903. The Durbar of 1903 was held in Delhi to celebrate the succession of the British monarch King Edwardville, the great-grandfather of the current British monarch, Queen Elizabeth I, as the Emperor of India. The Delhi Durbar was organized by Lord Curzon, India's viceroy at the time. The original plan was for Edward himself to come to India for a special coronation ceremony, but when the king refused. He was conspicuously less interested in India than Victoria had been, Curzon decided to stage a massive spectacle instead. After two years planning, the ceremonies began on December 29, 1902 with a lavish parade of elephants through the streets. Guests included a wide range of Indian princes and Maharajas, with the Duke of Connaught representing the British royal family. The Maharaja of Jammu and Kashmir, Maharaja brought along with him two of the tallest men, in the whole world it seems, from Kashmir. One of the giants was 7 feet 9 inches tall, 2.36 m, while the shorter one was a mere 7 feet 4 inches tall, 2.23 m, and according to various sources they were indeed twin brothers. They created quite an impression at the Durbar as they literally stood heads and shoulders above the rest. The brothers were known as the two Kashmir giants and were elite riflemen in the service of the Maharaja. The event was attended by international journalists and photographers, one of them being James Rickleton, an American traveler and photographer who managed to get a few pictures with the two giants of Kashmir. We don't know exactly how tall Rickleton was, but judging by his photographs he surely loved posing with the two giants of Kashmir. The Brisbane Courier printed in February 1903, had an article titled The Retinue of the Ruler of Kashmir included a fine detachment of cuirassiers and a huge giant. Probably the reporter didn't see the other giant. One of the original captions claims that the Kashmiri brothers were originally from a place called Balmokhand. Unfortunately, we can't locate this place in Kashmir, maybe the name changed or someone got it wrong. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to my channel.